Hi, welcome to another edition of Azure Every Day. My name is Bob Rubaki and I'm a consultant with Pragmatic Works. And I want to share a tip with you uh, if you're getting started with data factory data flows and related specifically to reusing uh, file connections that you may have set up uh, in Azure Data Factory prior to using data flows. So maybe you were building some pipelines and you were pulling data from files, et cetera, and you want to reuse those for data flow. Uh, and I ran into a problem here, I wanted to share this with you. The long and the short of it is that you cannot reuse those existing connections uh, and you'll have to recreate them. And so looking at the screenshot here, I want to show you a little bit more specifically what I'm talking about. Here I had created a new uh, data flow in Data Factory and I created a source on my work canvas there. And under the settings, I wanted to pick a data set and point to a file that I had set up previously. And so on the left side here, you can see that I have uh, a couple file data sets previously created. They're still there, but they're not available as selections on my source data set within Dataflow. So I needed to recreate them. Now this is actually pretty nice. When I do create a new data set and I choose that I want to point to my Azure Data Lake linked service, this is the menu that I see now. So this is a lot nicer than what it was before. And here I've got now a specific choice for uh, delimited text, which is what I was using in my case here. So I go through it, I choose delimited text and set up the, uh, the, the data set. And if you look at the JSON underneath it, you can see that the formatting is definitely different. So they've made some changes here. Uh, but once I do that, uh, and now I move on back to my, uh, my data flow and under the same source, now when I drop down my source data set, I can see that I have that newly created data set as an option available to be selected and used in my data flow. And you'll note here also that um, still the, the couple files that I had created previously still are not available as choices, but the one that I recreated or created new is available. I hope you found this quick tip about data factory, data flows helpful, useful. If you have any questions about Azure Data Factory, data flows, or data warehousing in Azure, please reach out, let us know. Thank you.